7 o'clock on let's say Thursday morning, bright and early. And I'm headed down to the mechanics to see if I can't get these brake lights fixed today. And then I'm gonna run around and get a few more supplies here in town. <coughs> Go for a swim later today. Just to give you an idea, this is where I woke up this morning. You can see out there. And Nora slept well, and we're all ready to go. Nora's still waking up, huh? Those are all car shows, destruction derby, and drag race. The derby's here in town, right? Yeah. What are you using the derby? Uh, I haven't been serving for years. We used to use Chrysler Imperials. Watching them dogs barking up trees. Don't you know the mystery of the birds and the bees? That dog come walking in here. I thought you were my jewels. I thought it was too for a minute. And then I noticed you didn't have white on it. <laughs> She must, she's a familiar face around these parts. I've heard a few people say that looks like my dog back home. She just got one of them that looks almost exactly like her. I met a guy on the track the other day that said he has one that looks exactly like her at home. So, Oregon bird dogs, I guess. What breed is this? Lab. That's what I thought. You're a You gotta watch that tail. Yeah, they hit pretty hard with the tail. Me and Nora just been hanging out at the library. For the most part, they let Nora come in and sit with me. Very nice down there. They have internet connection just as fast as you can get it. So that's going to be one of my big goals as I travel and continue on this journey. It's not only to document it, but to get it to you the very next day. It's making friends, Nora? Oh, yeah. Huh? Hi, Rudy. You're a good looking girl. Hi. My dog died right after 18 years. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, that was kind of a bummer. So, I gotta get on down to the mechanic and pick up my truck. You hear, Jesse? Alright, no worries. Hi, buddy. How'd we do? Go. That was fast. Got y'all going. Appreciate that. This upper bearing is a little. It looks a lot better. But, but it's, it's not going to come off in your lap. You got brake lights, turn signals. The turn signal switch isn't real, real good. Yeah, I, I know this is flashy. On the right hand side, sometimes you have to hold it up. Alright. And I think that was already that way. Yeah. So, but it's. Try to drive straight. Alright, how much do I for Let me go look. So you're just out traveling around the country, huh? That's the plan. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm headed east, so I do have a consistent direction. This is the time I put in it yesterday, finding the part, okay. the switch, replacing the switch, and fixing the stern call. Good deal. That call up is a bitch. Yeah, no, I, that's going to make me feel a lot better driving across the country. Go ahead and take the 140, like you said, on up to uh, Little Mountain. Mm -hmm. It looks like there's a few creeks to stop at along the way with some trees around and yeah, there's, some shade. There's some, uh, a lot of nothing out there too. Yeah. There's miles and miles of nothing. Well, I like that though. That desert can yeah. get real pretty at the right time. Watch of day. for wild horses and burrows. Yeah, I'm gonna get stuck in my water right now. Get water in the ice chest and get some goodies and then uh we'll good to go. Hey, okay. thank you. Hey, thank you. The car is back, the steering column is tight. Brake lights are working, I have insurance, I am ready to be pulled over. Because I'm all legal. No, I shouldn't say that, I don't want to be pulled over. But if I do get pulled over, they're not going to take my car away from me, because I got my paper straight enough. Appreciate it. See ya.
bad place to have to spend the summer? No, no, I thought it got Parents' house rolled out in the middle of the street. Uh-huh. There's nobody around. Finally, this guy comes jogging by him. Asks if he can grab my wheelchair for me. And he looks around and he points to my wheelchair in the street and goes, That one right there? Yeah, that's the one. I can't believe you said that. No, that the wheelchair right for there. miles around. <laughs> yeah. He just wanted to make sure it was the right one. Deep Creek. I overshot it by maybe, oh, I don't know, 10, 15 miles, which really hurts because it's a long ways to the next gas station, but uh, hopefully I still got enough. So that wasn't fun. I sure had to see some beautiful country. That's probably what distracted me. I was just flying along looking at the, uh, the sun setting. And I don't know exactly if this is the spot I saw on Google Earth, but it's going to work for tonight. Yeah, I don't know. I guess I'm in a foul mood. Laura seems to be happy, though. There goes the head into the water. I'm definitely exhausted from the day. I, uh... This wasn't the spot I was anticipating it to be for camping. I was planning on staying here at least two nights. So, we'll see. Maybe I'll feel better about the area tomorrow. I just left Lakeview. I was just swimming with... 16 year old lifeguards on watch and having a great time and Laura's eating some something dead and foul over there. She smells of it when she comes over here. It's not making the night go any better. It's hard to convey a mood through the camera and put it into words. For all you picky wine drinkers out there, I don't think I've ever ran into a bottle of red wine that I didn't like. Anyways, I do feel a little bit more relaxed, just like I thought I would. I am going to go organize the situation inside the Jeep and pass out. A baby girl, and I love her to death, even though she eats death. That's for you, Nora. <laughs>